Cancer, are we live? We are. Good evening. It's your girl Moniqua. And you know we here for, girl, your May monthly reading. Cancer, I don't be talking to you a lot. It's fine, girl. You be comfortable in your shell. I understand, okay? I have a few Cancer places myself. All right? Thank you guys for all the continued support. Bookings, like, shares, comments, subscribes, recommendations, tips, all that. I really appreciate it. To book a personal tarot reading with me, my pricing, and my contact information will be in the description box down below or other info. We'll be in the pinned comment in the comment section. Make sure that you are liking the video and subscribing to the channel because you know what it does. It keeps me in rotation. Okay, follow me on all my uh, socials, which is in the description box as well. Instagram and TikTok, at Monique with the Mission with two eyes for both of them. All right. Cancer, you showed up in the Pisces reading, but I don't like the way you showed up, girl. Okay, so either a Pisces needs to be aware of you. Okay, or you need to be aware of a Pisces. So, um, y'all know how we do, you know how we do. Okay, we're going to go ahead and pull three zodiac signs to see what placements you guys might have, who could be around you during this time, okay, and who could be being nosy, and then we're going to pull a monthly oracle message card for you to get the overall energy for y'all in the month of May. A lot of you guys could be seeing a lot of spiritual confirmations and or symbols during this time. It's like a lot of things are like being confirmed for you in the month of May, all right? Pay attention to the signs type energy going on anyway. You making birthday plans? Okay, because I'm like, oh, your birthday coming up. But your birthday don't hit until the end of June, right? Yeah, it don't hit until, like, the uh, end of June. But, you know, girl, it's never too early to start playing for your birthday. All right, but some of y'all could be, you know what I'm saying, in the midst of, you know what I'm saying, making birthday plans, trying to figure out what you want to do for your birthday. All right, let's go ahead and get these zodiac signs going. Spirit, guys, what zodiac signs can resonate? Oh. Okay, some of y'all might have a Gemini around you or have heavy Gemini on your chart. So, you guys, what zodiac signs can resonate with this Cancer reading for the month of May in the year 2022? I don't know how you feel about the Gemini, though. I'm going to be honest. You're a little questionable about the Gemini. You're a little bit iffy about the Gemini. Bro, intuition been immaculate. As of recent, bitch, what, girl, you saw me shuffle the cards, bitch. This ain't no funny business going on. All right, what's the first card out? First day out. I don't know, some of y'all, somebody here around you could be getting out of jail. Okay, one of the tree, right? A Gemini, a Taurus, or a Scorpio. But I brought up when I brought up a Gemini, so, you know. Okay, so we got Gemini, Scorpio, and Taurus, all moons. Gemini moon, Scorpio moon, Taurus moon. So, in essence, rising as well. Gemini rising, Taurus rising, and Scorpio rising. Okay? These zodiac signs could be around you during the time you have those placements. Okay, that what I said. Or, you know, these zodiac signs could be being nosy. But who's really being nosy? Oh. Cancer, they could be a Virgo being nosy during this time in regards to your ass okay heavy earth sign energy is out here i don't know some of y'all might have heavy earth in your chart might be a lot of earth signs around you during this time let's pull this monthly oracle massage spirit guys i don't know some of y'all need a massage maybe yes girl i'm trying to get cracked out okay and i don't mean like that spirit guys what's going on with the cancer zodiac for the month of may For the month of May in the year 2022. Yeah, girl, I'm trying to get rubbed on. I don't know, Cancer. Some of y'all, Cancer, you know how you be, okay? Some of y'all might be trying to, like, I'm just trying to be touched. <laughs> I don't know, Cancer. What's going on with you, girl? Are you going through withdrawals of some kind, girl? I don't know. I did bring up cracked out earlier, so I don't know. Let me stop. All right. I'm judging. All right, but I don't know. Some of y'all just want to be touched. I don't know. What you got going on, Cancer? So, you guys, I don't know. Maybe you touchy-feely in the month of May. What's going on with the Cancer Zodiac for the month of May in the year 2022? Okay, girl, somebody here has just gotten out of jail around you, Cancer, okay? Shift the perspective, okay? So, y'all know this is my bird's eye view card looking at things from, a, a like I said, a broader perspective, okay? Bird's eye view. And this is in regards to you being done with a certain situation, cancer. Okay, some of y'all could be, you know, I'm hearing calling it a quits with a certain situation. I don't know if it's with a person. I heard a certain situation because you're looking at things from a broader perspective. It's like, I'm looking at the bigger picture now. So there's certain things you could be, you know what I'm saying, done with. You feel me? Because it's like, I'm looking at the bigger picture now. Okay, girl. Some of y'all could be getting some money or getting to the money or getting some money in the months. Of May, because my right hand itching, and y'all know this, this is my receiving hand, okay? Let 
ladies, what's going on? Queen of Cups, girl, why are you in your feelings? I told y'all, some of y'all, I'm trying to get rubbed down. Okay, I don't know. Some of y'all could be um, feeling a little bit more emotionally. Can y'all help me out? What's the word I'm looking for? Emotionally inclined during this time. Just, I just feel like some of y'all might be emotionally triggered a lot easier during this time. Like... <laughs> I don't know, girl. There's just certain shit that I will tear up at. Okay, girl. It's going to hit me, bitch. Okay, girl. I'm a mystic. Okay, I'm very intuitive. So, there's certain shit that I feel. Okay, a lot of you guys are feelers. Okay, so like certain shows, certain, um, you know what I'm saying, movies, things that you see on the TV, you know, emotionally affect y'all. Some of y'all are definitely um very strong in past. So, I feel like things tend to affect you emotionally a lot more. Um a lot more than other people okay you feel emo you feel things emotionally a lot more intense than you know most people do all right water signs you watching somebody or somebody watching you girl there's no in between page of swords and the queen of cuz either you've been watching the air sign or air sign been watching you okay look at me being nosy i'm like <laughs> Page of Swords and the Six of Cups. Four Pentacles, Six of Cups, and the Page of Swords. So, yeah. Uh, Mr. and Mrs. and Tara Sante. I see that fool card. Six of Wands. Yeah. Some of y'all, somebody here from your past, somebody that you got a little bit of history with. Just, you know, people that you got some, you know, like I said, history with. You, you know someone here. Somebody here has been watching you. Keeping their distance, but they've been watching you. Okay. From a distance, like I said, somebody here from your past could be a fellow water sign, maybe a Scorpio, could be a Taurus, Six of Wands, Peking, could be a Leo, all right? Or you've been doing this to somebody. Yeah, I'm hearing somebody here might have been checking in on you, Cancer. Spirit guys, what's going on with the Cancer Zodiac for the month of May in the year 2022? Two of Cups. Oh, okay. Cancer, what happened, girl? It was so good. Okay, girl. Just about a week ago. Oh, shit. Two of Cups is the first card, which Cancer, that is your card. But the Eight of Cups is on the bottom of the deck. So, Whitney saying that, I don't know. Some of y'all, shit just changed, G. Like, things could have been real good with you and somebody. And then with the Eight of Cups, it's just like, shit not good. All right, hold on, girl. Just let me see for a minute. Okay, girl. All right, now. Let's go ahead and line these bad boys up. All right, now. So, I'm seeing this could go a variety of ways, okay? Some of y'all could have decided to leave a certain uh, connection, all right? That could be the person that's watching your girl because Eight of Cups is on the bottom of the deck. It could be somebody here that you have turned your back on that could still be, you know what I'm saying, keeping tabs on you. But with the Two of Cups, you could be in a very loving connection during this time. Could be with an Earth sign. Taurus and Virgo is out here very strong. Maybe with the Fire sign because I do see Ace of Wands out here, all right? But some of y'all could be in very loving connections during this time after you decide to walk away from something that maybe you just felt like wasn't your steez, okay? All right. Or the other, okay? Somebody here could be, you know what I'm saying, like a connection with somebody, shit good one day, and then, you know, next day somebody like, yo, I'm out. But to be honest with you, high fan magician in the moon car, I do see someone here, um, I don't want to say lying. I just feel like somebody here is keeping it a secret that they don't want to be with somebody anymore. Knight of Pentacles and the Page of Pentacles, they could be, you know what I'm saying, low-key trying to plan how they want to leave this person. But to be honest, I feel like they could be, you know, acting happy with this person. But behind closed doors, they like, how am I going to leave this person? Oh, my God. Hierophant, Magician, and the Moon card. Some of y'all, God has given you the um, ability to... Girl, you out here, Doctor Strange in it, girl. Go see Multiverse, bitch. It's great. Magician, the moon card. With the high fan, yeah. Some of y'all have been given the ability to kind of like, you got to see Multiverse to really understand the Doctor Strange movie. Dream walk, astral travel, all that. It's like being given the ability to 
manifest uh, certain things either out of your dreams, um, being able to see beyond the veil, okay? There's like an extra sense that I feel like you guys have been given from, you know what I'm saying, the divine. I ain't even realized it, bitch. Look at this. Magician, the Ace of Wands, I don't know. I'm not going to say witchcraft, but with the moon card, magician, the Ace of Wands, some of y'all do your own rituals, your own manifestation techniques, okay? Something that I feel like you do in secret, but with the higher thing here, I feel like you be, you know what I'm saying, like, girl, we connected. I, it's kind of like, you know, you're not out here, you know what I'm saying, um, you know, in the graveyard or some shit like that. Like, you you out here, like, you, um, you're respectful of the arts, basically. Master of the mystic arts, okay, basically. Dr. Strange is in here, okay. Keep it low-key. Okay, I feel like, uh, who had this? No, this is in my Venus and Aries transit. Some of y'all, I feel like anything that you're trying to manifest during this time, any new project, new venture, just new chapter, shh, keep it to yourself during this time. Nine of Pentacles and the Page of Pentacles, especially if it involves you Eight of Cups walking away from something or you're still in the process of planning it. You feel me? Spirit guys, what's going on with the Cancer Zodiac for the month of May? In the year 2022. And some of y'all could be going on a date with your um with your spouse, with your significant other in the month of May. Look at this, okay? Ace of Wands with the Hermit card out here. Yeah, some of y'all could be trying something new with a uh, significant other in the month of May. You might go to like a candle making class. It's like you experiencing something new with your bae. All right, I'm a fan of it. Some of y'all, this could be in regards to a fire sign or an earth sign person. All right, but I do see some of y'all having like date night out here. Okay, <laughs> it's going to end really lovely. Okay, y'all know the Ace of Wands is a very phallic energy. Look at the, look at the candles, girl. I, it's our anniversary. I don't know, some of y'all could be having an anniversary in the month of May and you celebrating this with this person okay hermit card judgment card in the page of swords yeah some of y'all there's somebody here outside your energy that is watching you during this time my ear burning it's the right ear okay hermit card judgment card page of swords and the six of cups somebody that you got a little bit of history with yeah girl my ear burning girl what is this confirmations girl are we live okay yeah they hear us okay anyway yeah divine feminine Empress card, star card. Who is this other lady, though? Queen of Pentacles, Five of Wands, King of Pentacles. Wait a minute. Hold on, because I got to read that. Hold on, girl. Let me line it all up, honey. You got time? Okay, let me hurry up. Divine Feminine, Empress card. You are out here. So is Mystic, High Priestess with the Devil card. Let me talk to you real fast, because you, sh you beside the star card, Empress, Divine Feminine, so this is good. Okay, some of y'all, there's somebody here from your past. It could be specifically an earth sign, a fire sign. Your earth and fire is out here heavy, all right? Um, this could be somebody here that puts you in a third party. This could have been toxic friends. You still picking up on this person's energy. High priestess, you still feel them around you. Well, for one page of swords, they still be watching you. Some of y'all, there's someone's energy that you still feel because they still be watching you, son. All right. Some of y'all, this is another feminine energy, heavy on the earth, heavy on the fire. Leo is out here strong. Taurus and Capricorn is out here strong. This could be somebody here that's with somebody. King and the Queen of Pentacles is here. Girl, what? Girl, I don't know what you got to do with this lady, all right? Some of y'all, there's some, either there's a couple watching you or somebody that's dealing with someone that's watching you during this time, kid, all right? Girl, you really got a hold on me. So this isn't just puppy love. Okay, yeah, girl, you got a hold on somebody, Cancer, all right? Or somebody got a hold on you. Girl, you really... Okay, girl, you really got a hold on me, G. High Priestess, Devil Card, Cherry Card, and Three of Cups. Somebody uh, feels like you have a hold on them, Cancer. Or you feel like uh, someone here has a hold on you, all right? I still see somebody here still watching somebody, still picking up on their energy. Somebody out here toxic, though. I'm going to be honest. Cancer is either you or some Earth sign energy. This Devil Card, Three of Cups, Cherry Card, Devil, High Priestess, and the Five of Wands... It, Cancer, it's either you or some earth sign energy, maybe a Leo. Girl, my ear fucking burning, G. We're fucking live. Come on, G. <laughs> Come on. Serious, 
Spirit guys. Some of y'all going out on a date. Misty. Hey. Come on now. Don't be talking my business. Okay, 15, 15. Girl, listen. Get out my business. My business. Okay, high priestess. Two of Cups, Ace of Wands, and the High Priestess. Yeah, some of y'all could be going out on a date in the month of May. I don't feel like you, you know, you kind of want to keep it low-key. Girl, why? You funny. Anyway, Seven of Wands is out here. Yeah, some of y'all, there's somebody energy um, outside of you. Seven of Wands on the bottom of the deck, heavy on the fire energy. You still pick up on this person energy. Two of Cups and the Ace of Wands, you might be in a new connection. Yeah, some of y'all could be in a whole, like, new connection, all right? Or like I said, some of y'all picking up on somebody energy during this time. That with the Seven of Wands, girl. Stiff arm. Go, go away. Yeah, Seven of Wands, Six of Swords, and the Knight of Swords. You don't talk to this person. Ace of Cups. Mm. Heavy on the air. Aquarius is out here very strong. King of Swords, Knight of Swords, and the Six of Swords. Some of y'all, there's someone here that I feel like you could be stiff arming during this time. Ace of Cups and the Nine of Cups. I'm cool, all right? I, I feel like you still pick up on this person's energy. Some of y'all, this is the person here that's asking you out on a date, all right? Knight of Swords is like, I don't know, they trying to move some shit around, or it's just like real just... It's real unorganized, girl. People don't listen. Man, ask me out. I just let him do his thing, girl. I ain't finna suggest no shit. I'm trying to see what you about. All right? I ain't finna suggest nothing, girl. You know, let me know. Okay? Y'all funny. See you guys. What's going on with the Cancer Zodiac for the month of May in the year 2022? Temperance. Oh. With the magician, girl, who are you? Fucking Spider-Man, what do you mean, okay? Yeah, some of y'all definitely have been ordained with some sort of, like, prophetic gift, okay? With the magician card and the ace of wands out here, some of y'all, you know, if you can make it here, you can make it anywhere. I just feel like you can create anything out of, like, you can create nothing out of something. Just, you can create something out of nothing, 1717 when I said that, all right? Yeah, some of y'all could be in, like, a, a real good relationship, G. Like, it could be most definitely with a fire sign. Sag and Leo has come out heavy. Maybe an earth sign. All right, Virgo and Taurus is out here. All right, I just feel like some of y'all could be in a connection. And it's like, like, girl, is this real? <laughs> like, girl, like, this feel real good. I'm telling y'all, some of y'all having date night. Could be anniversary type teas. Or like I said, you're having some sort of date night in the month of May, okay? What's this high priestess energy? Oh, this you, girl, magician, nine priest. I'm telling y'all, some of y'all master of the mystic arts, okay? Dr. Strange, bitch, okay? With the world card, I told you. I be reading the fuck out of these cards. Thank you, God, all right? Magician, the world card. You can make something out of nothing, kid, all right? I don't even really feel like you be needing the ace, but when they come in, when they come in, they come in handy, all right? Like I said, a lot of you guys have a prophetic gift. You, uh, I, I knew I'm fucking psychic. Okay, I knew this would happen. I'm fucking psychic. All right. Three of Wands, Devil card, and a Chariot. All right, now. With the Star card. All right, now. Wait a minute. Mm-mm. It's not real. Because usually you know how they say in tarot, the Chariot follows the Star card, not when it's like this. Devil card. This is something here being made to look like the star, okay? Being made to look like it's on your path. Divine Feminine, Empress card, you need to be careful about this. Something being made to look like it's in alignment with you is not, though. But I feel like with the High Priestess, you intuitive to know when something here is a knockoff, okay? To know when something here is being shape-shifted, okay, girl? I don't know the lines on the outside. It's like something here being Photoshopped, all right? Divine Feminine, somebody here, you, uh, how do you say this? There's somebody from your past that I feel like, um, has a hold on you or you have a hold on them, all right? To be honest, with your cards coming out like this, I feel like you got a hold on them. With the Tempest card, you know this is my <laughs> water card type, uh, energy. This is also, like, my soul card, my prayer card, all right? So some of y'all have, like, this, a uh, holy anointed vibe to you that I feel like it's just addictive, okay? Intoxicating. Some of y'all have a very intoxicating aura about you, kid. All right? Somebody come across you like, oh my God, okay? Some of y'all, you walk past somebody and they smell you. Not, not in a bad way. Let's hope not, okay? Um, But some you walk past somebody and they smell you and it's like, they get captivated, G. Girl. 
I put a set on you and now you mine, okay? I hope not. Magician, four of wands, and the ace of wands. Some of y'all could be um in the midst of a move, manifesting a new home if you haven't already. All right. Spirit guys. Oh, what's going on with the Cancer Zodiac for the month of May in the year 2022? My ear's still burning. This the right ear, though, so it's good stuff. All right. Well, it's not. Five of wands with the two of pentacles. Mm. Some of y'all, there could be some issues, dilemmas, problems that I feel like you might have to, you know what I'm saying, solve, um, tie up loose ends, uh, take care of in the month of May, all right? Just pay attention to your intuition. You're going to be on autopilot. Um, it's like um, being given. I'm giving you all the security and cheat codes, all right? Hierophant came out, though. I sort of feel like some of y'all, mm, be careful about what comes from God and what comes from the devil because Hierophant and the devil card and came out. Yo, the devil must really be trying to corrupt y'all. Because the devil trying to look like the star card. It's like, damn, I know I can't get you with the toxic shit. <sighs> I gotta look like the holy shit, alright? I told you it's like knockoff energy around your kid. Two of Pentacles, death. With the five of swords and the moon card. Hold up, hold up. Yeah, man. What the fuck is this? Yeah. I see somebody here not being honest about the fact that they want to leave somebody. Eight of Cups, Hierophant, Moon card, Five of Swords, uh, Death card, and Two of Pentacles. Five of Swords will go with this Five of Wands. Yeah, I see somebody here, Moon card, and the High Priest is trying to make it seem like some connection with somebody. It's like, it's great. But I mean, like, girl, it can't be great. Five of Swords and the Five of Wands. I mean, everybody argue with, like, they significant other or whoever they in a relationship with. But with the Death card here, man, I'm hearing this shit was been supposed to be over with the Two of Pentacles. Somebody here keep going back and forth with a situation where it's like, girl, we've already called it. All right, Death card. This is null and void. Temperance is out here. Somebody here keeps trying to heal a situation with someone that, like, girl, it's going to keep starting, starting, ending, starting, ending, starting, ending. All right. This could be in regards to an earth sign, Capricorn and Taurus is out here, or a fire sign, um, Leo and Sag is out here. Some of y'all, I feel like the universe, your dreams hold a lot of different um, answers. Some of y'all pay attention to your dreams. There's going to be a lot of answers being brought to you, all right? Some of y'all, there could be somebody here competing against you in regards to being happy, all right? It's like somebody here wants to prove that they're happier than you, that they're doing better than you, all right? The only difference that I see is one person is actually happy and doing good, and the other person is faking being happy and doing good. It's a sad life. That's a sad life to live, yo. It's that double life type shit. Like, how you live your life, girl? Let's move on. Spirit guys, what's going on with the Cancer Zodiac for the month of May in the year 2022? Eight of Pentacles with the Queen of Swords. Yeah, I told you, somebody here keep trying to heal a certain situation with someone that is... Well, what y'all want to say, y'all? What y'all want to say this person is... I heard untreatable. Let's not do that. I ain't diagnosing nobody. I ain't no doctor. All right. It's like somebody here is unsatisfiable, G. Queen of Swords, Ten of Swords, and the Two of Swords. I see somebody here with the Temperance, Five of Wands, and the Eight of Pentacles. They keep trying to heal or make something work with somebody to where it's like, I don't want to say they don't want to make it work, but with Ten minus Two, they equals Eight of Swords and the Queen of Swords. First of all, that's a nut. All right. This lady is a nut. Okay. Or this is just somebody that I feel like, um, well, they're not happy. Ungrateful is what I heard. Very ungrateful person. Like with the five of wands out here with the ace of wands, this person might be uh, fueled by drama and the conflict. If that's not going on, they're going to try to create it. All right. I see somebody out here. Like I said, it, it, it's like a mismatch of energy out here. Somebody here trying to make it, a peaceful person trying to make it work with somebody here who um, despises peace. Okay. They feel like it ain't no, um, Say it again, y'all. They feel like shit ain't exciting if things are peaceful. That's a weird OG. That's a nut, all right? <laughs> That's a nut. 
high priest is above the eight of pentacles some of y'all could be keeping your goals ambitions uh aspirations low-key during this time all right because with the five of wands and the five of swords coming out some of y'all know you got people around you that like you know what i'm saying like patooey okay spit on your shit all right or you know what i'm saying niggas praying on your downfall tempers cards like some of y'all do have people outside you that are praying on your downfall well, high priest is coming out. I feel like some of y'all know who these people are. Some of y'all definitely know what's the air sign. Queen of Swords, Ten of Swords, and the Two of Swords, all right? Yep, sun card. Some of y'all, there's been certain people that have been exposed that I feel like they don't want to see you move. They don't want to see you grow. They don't want to see you expand, all right? I think this could be with a fire sign, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, an air sign, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Spirit, guys, what's going on with the Cancer Zodiac for the month of May? In the year 2022. Some of y'all got people like that at work. You ever had somebody in the world like, why are you so happy? Well, Page of Swords with the Ace of Swords. Yeah, Cancer. <laughs> Two of Cups, Temperance, and the Page of Swords. Now, some of y'all, this is a spirit guy watching you. Oh, Lord. Okay, death card did come out. My condolences. Some of y'all, there's someone here near and dear to you. It doesn't have to be a lover, but it is out here. Someone that I feel like you showed a very close bond in a relationship with. This person still watches over you. Excuse me. You might still, like, feel this person's energy around you. You might still have dreams about this person. They're definitely still around you, son. All right? You might still send prayers up to this person. You might have offerings out for this person. You still kind of, like, keep this person in remembrance in some sort of white eye. Okay? Yeah. Queen of Cups. Feminine energies. This could be going for you. Queen of Cups and the Ace of Swords. Somebody watching you. High Priestess, Five of Wands, and the Page of Swords, heavy on the earth, heavy on the fire. Leo and Taurus and Sag is showing up the heaviest, okay? If you watching this person or this person watching you, Cancer, all right? This person got some sort of beef with you? Five of Wands, this person could have some sort of beef with you, uh, son? Like, what? One got beef with the other, and the other one, like, peace and love, all right? Because the temperance out here with the five of wands. Like, somebody here still has some sort of, like, like I said, conflict and a beef with the, with the, uh, with one. And the other one is like, yo, I really, I really hope you're doing well. That's a, wow, that's weird, G. No, somebody here could be bitter. Spirit guys, what's going on with the Cancer Zodiac for the month of May in the year 2022? Ten of Swords, Sun card. Leo is very happy out here. <laughs> we got two Leo cards showing us so far. All right, but Fire sign energy is heavy out here as well because Ace of Wands out here. Page of Swords and the Ten of Swords. Ace of Wands, Five of Wands, and Ten of Swords. Yes, yeah, some of y'all there's someone here that you have called a quits with um, that is still watching you. But to be honest with you, with the Page of Swords coming out and your reading Cancer, there's some Cancers out here still watching. Someone, and there's some cats out here still being watched by someone. Heavy on the fire, heavy on the earth. Maybe a little bit of, uh, I was about to say Gemini. A little bit of Gemini, all right? Yeah. I don't know. Somebody here could still be um, in the midst of some sort of divorce, all right? King and the Queen of Pentacles is out here with the High Fan, Eight of Cups, and the Death card, but with the Two of Pentacles and the Moon card. It's like somebody here is realizing that they're not happy with someone, but they're still kind of on the fence about leaving and or divorcing from this person. But with the sun and the moon card out here, either the eclipse energy is really making this person like emotionally feel the weight of still kind of being still kind of being on and off with this. Or like I said, it's that double light type shit going on. It's catching up with somebody. It's like somebody here keeps trying to uh, portray the fact they're happy with someone that makes them very unhappy. All right. Here, five of cups, nine of swords, and the moon card. Somebody here is very, like, I'm hearing unstable dealing with a certain partner here. But with the sun card, it's like they got to look happy. Girl, it's driving them crazy. This could most definitely be with a fire sign or an earth sign. Maybe a fellow water sign. Scorpio is out here. I'm going to be honest. Some of y'all, there's somebody here watching you that's going through that. Or you watching somebody that's going through that. Last card. Spirit guys, what's going on with the Cancer Zodiac for the month of May in the year 2022? Some of y'all decide to quit a job and find a new one. Damn! 
moon card. So we got Cancer Moon and Cancer Rising showing up. I said Diam, okay, because we got the High Priestess, Eight of Pentacles, and the Moon card. I told you, keep your goals, your aspirations, your uh, ambitions a secret during this time, girl. Just work on it, all right? A lot of you guys, uh, bro, you got some some um, some strong manifestation powers. I don't know what you do, but whatever you do, it works. All right, Eight of Pentacles, you see the progress in it. Some of y'all got some strong manifestation skills, okay? I told you, Dr. Strangers, a lot of Dr. Strangers in here. All right, Eight of Wands, you receive a lot of symbols, confirmations. And I say that again in the reading, you're going to be receiving a lot of spirit uh, confirmations, um, symbols, signs in regards to a lot of things um, in the month of May. Things that you could be um, wondering about. Pay attention to your dreams, y'all. Yo. So many um, messages are coming through in your dreams. Somebody here that's watching you is showing up in your dreams, too. Page of Swords, Ten of Swords, and the Moon card. Some of y'all, your dream is telling you to end a certain situation with somebody. Heavy on the fire, heavy on the air, all right? It's like you having dreams about fighting somebody, being in an argument with somebody. That's, you know, that's the universe. Like, yo, be out, okay? What is this, bro? Oh, bro. I see somebody here either lying about a pregnancy or deciding to be pro-choice. Let me just say that. Yeah, pay attention to your dreams, okay? Hi, man. King of Cups. Bro, what is this? Man, what the fuck is this? Some of y'all bored. Either you bored in a love connection or your, your, your circle, boring. Boring. Whack. Okay, I'm just be honest, girl. All right, some of y'all want some new friends. You want some new experiences, okay? Man, don't you don't you be telling me that you're getting lazy out here. Okay, four of swords and the eight of swords, girl. You just be on the couch. Your job could be real boring, okay? You just, you just living a boring life. I don't know. Some of y'all got kids. Okay, girl, you, it's just daddy mode all the time, girl. I'm a fan, all right? <laughs> I'm a fan, but I don't know. Some of y'all, your life could be a little bit uh, mundane during this time. Like I said, you got mundane people around you, kid. You couldn't notice, okay? I see some vice versa energy out here too. Cancer, you could be watching somebody that's watching you. It's vice versa. Page of Swords, High Priest, and the Moon card. It's like, this is gonna sound real weird, but some of y'all got some sort of like telekinetic or telepathic. Girl, I'm about to go over for y'all shit. It's 11 11 while I'm looking this up too. Girl, thank you. I'll be reading the fuck out these cards. It's just facts. Okay. Hold on, I'm about to look it up. Telekinetic, cause I, I don't, cause I heard telekinetic, but it could be um. Let me fucking find out that y'all are fucking. Yo, my hands itching. Hell yeah. So, psychokinesis or telekinesis is a claimed psychic ability allowing a person to influence a physical system without physical interaction. Basically being able to move shit with your mind. There is no spoon. Okay, that's where the energy goes. You out here bending spoons and shit. Some of y'all definitely have some psychic capabilities, G. Okay, Ace of Wands, Page of Swords, High Priest, and the Moon card. Some of y'all have prophetic abilities. You're able to see... Uh, things in your dream. It's in the Bible about all the spiritual gifts that you know what I'm saying. God hands down to his children. All right. But some of y'all definitely um, possess some sort of physical, uh, not physical, um, psychic ability. All right. But like I said, some of y'all have some sort of telepathic connection with somebody. You think of them when they thinking of you. You dream of them when they dream of you. I got to get out of here, Cancer. You, you don't usually go over like this, honey. Okay, girl? It's late night. What y'all got me up like this for? That was y'all May monthly reading. Any placement of Cancer, but Cancer Moon slash Cancer Rising is out here heavy. Like the video, leave a comment telling me it just resonated with you in any way. Subscribe to the channel. My pricing and my content information will be in the description box down below. All other info will be in the pinned comment and comment section. All right, y'all. Let me go ahead and get up out of here. My hands is itching. Let me get out of here, okay? <laughs> Bye.